Hey, I'm May Will. Oh, Carissa. My name's Liz, and I'm dirty, but I'm not dirty everywhere. <laughs> Welcome back to Sunday afternoon. I think we talked to you Sunday late morning. Now, we're gonna do our little haul because our feetsies are tired, we're exhausted. So first, my mini shame. Hey, I may will. Oh, Carissa. My name's Lance and I'm dirty, but I'm not dirty everywhere. You got any more pickup lines, Lance? You're not pretty. Tiny, tiny. Okay, there's my first shame. Not very okay, and then. Oh, that's why no, no. I I didn't get this um, chain of Kooky Holland. Is that from Fate Zero? Yeah, from well, Fate Stay Night. Oh, okay. But yeah, from the Fate series. Oh. I got more shit from the Fate series too, but that's in the car. Oh, okay. And I got this from Brooke, which I uh, I don't know. I probably like to retweet it or something. Life is strange, Brooke. Lilith Noel. Noel. I'll put it on in editing. That's usually what she goes by online and stuff. Yeah, and then there's that. Alright, we're gonna show our hats together. And we have Bam Bitch. We have these hats. Pretty sure I'm gonna design a cosplay like specifically around this just being completely trashy. I'm All real right. stoked about it. Sounds like a colossal con. <laughs> that sounds fit. like a perfect colossal <laughs> con. Yeah. Yeah. Or a washi con. We're gonna oh my god! We're gonna be the coolest MFers there. Yeah, feel like you colossal. Both places. <laughs> okay. We're gonna be Pigeon Lance. Yeah. Fresh bins extraordinaire. And if you can see. Right here. <laughs> this is our home. Here, that's our home. Well, there's trash, there's trash right behind right you. Behind you. <laughs> they're sparkly. Yeah, sparkly. I was just gonna show that. Yeah, they're sparkly. Which is pretty fucking awesome. Pretty excited about this, even though I've literally never worn a snapback in my life. Pretty great. Yeah, they're pretty awesome. I'm then I pretty have sure it's gonna look real silly on my brain. Is that all the thing? And then I have some buttons in here. I got wine, mom. If you're married. I'd rather be a cat. Uh, 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 Beck got me this really cute Flash family with Bart and Barry and Wallace. And then I have Kozen down here from Sayuki Gaiden. We're really a, we're really a blast, whatever the fuck you want to say. Hey, I got, I got a really cute, adorable Fennekin and a gay-ass alpaca. Yeah, you do. I love him. He's wonderful. And then, Courtney is trash. Courtney loves cosplay, so I want two wigs. An improvement wig for Pidge, probably also Matt, which of course you can borrow if you'd like, because right. I think it's going to be wonderful for him. And uh, my, my very exciting white one, <laughs> as I'm literally wearing the straight yes. version right now, Yes. Uh, for Allura. So yeah. I'm excited. I'm thinking I'd like to try to have that for Definitely next Yoma, but I, I don't. Are we? What cons are we doing next year that are big that I could do this uh, at? We'll like this isn't a Washicon thing. I'm no. sorry, I'm not dressing up like this for Washicon. No, we're dressing up as trash for Washicon. <laughs> Fuck yeah, we are. <laughs> we're being trash for Washicon, apparently. Yes, trash for Washicon. Trash for Colossal yeah. <laughs> Always trash for yeah. Colossal Con. I think that's our only other big one, unless you wanted to find somewhere else to go. God damn, it's... Because then we have uh, uh, C2V2, I'm going to Motor City probably, and then I was yeah. going to ask, like it's still little, but I was going to ask if you want to do a full weekend to Doki Dokon, just because it's fun. Doki Dokon was fun. Yeah. I would like to do that one again. I wouldn't yeah. mind doing that one again either. Yeah, it and was, it's moved it was places because they outgrew it already. Yeah, Doki Dokan did a really, really good yeah, job, they did. and I was very impressed. So. And I'll have the summer off, so. And that won't be a big deal. It's like a weekend con, and the room we got was like 50 bucks. Yeah. So we can do the same thing again. It'll be the four of us, probably. Yeah. yeah. With Tori somewhere. The four of us. Yes, Tori is right there. <laughs> Here she is. <laughs> 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 Cats like trash cans. 
that's like what they do. They like to get into things. Yeah. Right? Alley cats, yeah. yeah. What was your favorite part of this convention? Wow, we're doing this not in the car. I don't know well, what we to have say. Well, we have here. Beck will be here. Ellie won't be true. here. True. <laughs> it's very true. We always like miss this. Yeah. Oh. It's only us. <laughs> Come back to me. I'm startled. Okay. Huh? Beck, what was your favorite part of the convention? How awesome Beck looked in four. Yeah. I did. I did. I definitely got that. Where you're like, what? I definitely got your look of horror. Like, my look of horror? What? My look of horror? Yeah, because I was like, what is your favorite convention? You're like... <laughs> I'm bad at thinking of stuff on the spot. Okay. I will start. I will start. Give you time. <laughs> Okay, well now That's I'm giving you more. The horror happened. I can answer though. You can't answer? <laughs> well now you have to wait. Okay, fine. <laughs> this is the key to wait. I don't want to answer anymore. <laughs> you, you will answer. <laughs> Bring me my fur coat. <laughs> you down for a little bit. Bring <laughs> me my kimono. <laughs> okay, my favorite part was honestly, again, probably photo shoots because I'm an egotistical maniac. But being in Starbucks was really fun, even though the baristas for sure didn't give a shit about me. Like, they were like, okay, what do you want? <laughs> like, but a lot of people that came up were like, do you work here? And I'm like, no. Uh, no. How late are you open? I'm like, I don't actually work here. So, so that was amusing. Because they're like, oh, oh, you're like, Cosplaying Star Wars, like you don't work here. I'm like, yes, <laughs> you're right. <laughs> uh, Katie was Tim Hortons, and the Tim Hortons employees actually asked for a picture, so it was super cute. We got super cute photos in them. And we already told you on Friday that apparently Tim Hortons is a dank meme for whatever fucking reason, because it's Katie. And one of the photo shoots, we did the Dream Daddy photo shoot, and I got real lit and merry like that wine glass did not leave my hand for a long time so real lit and i got to hit on um sports dad with heather as craig and then i really like my shame that i got of chance but i'll show you that in the car i'll have to remember to keep that out so oh yes okay we have an answer now what was your favorite <laughs> part? That did sit just plunge up a shit. <laughs> no, it was more like an annoyed fucking uh, guy. Tell me for the editing. I loved cosplaying everything. Yay! Which was everything I cosplayed, I had so much fun in. Yay! I'm so happy! I got to be an asshole in PA. Essentially, this whole weekend was just me being a dick with Tori, and it was great. And Except for right now. <laughs> Except for right now. I'm not supposed to be mean, but I'm too mean to not be <laughs> We're too, I'm too much mean of to dicks. not be mean. Yeah. <laughs> Sounds like my life in a nutshell. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, I really loved um, getting to finally cosplay core. Uh, and that just, it actually turned out all right, and people liked it. So yeah, that was nice. Yeah. All the paint chipped off my boots. Oh but no. But it was, was funny because there was a little trail in like the trail. walkway of like little red chips. And it oh, it like actually chipped off at the car. Yeah. yeah. Like I was walking and all of it, a sudden it was just like fucking red chips. It was chips funny because we were walking back from our hotel room and they were like so, coming. So it fell off when he was going back and we came back in the same outfit and he was like, oh, I think those are for my shoes. So basically, <laughs> back, what you did was you left, left a Hansel and Gretel style breadcrumb trail of paint chips so yes. you guys can remember where the hotel Yes. Back. But it was even better when we did a photo shoot thing with Courtney because every time I would sit down um, for like any photo or if I stood in one place for too long and I walked away, all of a sudden there was just like a fucking piece of red paint. Like, oh no. <laughs> boots were marking their territory. I was trying my best to like pick up what I could and it was just like, oh. <laughs> No. So started. So dramatic. It all started Thursday night when I got real lit. <laughs> I got real lit. 
and I, uh, I yelled at the popcorn ceiling because it was really uneven in my particular location then realized later that they fucked it up had to sand it down and, and like it they smeared it around a little bit mm -hmm. it was no good it was no good the floor of my hotel poor craftsmanship anyway uh, no in all seriousness uh, I did a lot of uh, photo shoots for people and I was at a photo shoot which I haven't it was just me and Kita and I hadn't done one with her since like number six which was Three-ish years ago? Yeah, that was like, what, 2014? I think so. So yeah. it's been a really long time, so it was really cool doing a shoot with Kita. Like, like with Kita. Like, Kita was in the shoot with me, not, like, right. shooting me. Like, we didn't book her for a shoot. Yes, we didn't oh. book Kita for a shoot. <laughs> yeah. Kita shot with me. <laughs> yeah. And so that was really fun, and I really enjoyed that. Um, the cosplays I did were... I actually did Blue Diamond, finally. Yeah, other than that, we just we did a lot of laughing. There was a lot of silliness that happened. I got to get to know Elliot, who was really cool. Not that Elliot, a different Elliot. You saw him. I'll put a little clip here. Yes. This Elliot. That, that Elliot. This Elliot, not this Elliot. Yeah. <laughs> Do not um, confuse that. So it was really cool to get to know him a little bit more. And Alana was in our room, so I got to know her a lot. Yeah. Which was awesome. Um, so yeah, it was just a good time, good friends, good cosplays, and uh, lots, of, lots of little giggles. All right. Don't think you're getting out of this. What was your favorite <laughs> part of the convention? Shit is happening in here. <laughs> Good to know. It's a panel. Uh, I didn't honestly, know. the uh, day one of doing it's the Uchiha adorable. Police Force because that ended up being unexpectedly more popular than we thought. Was that you? Yeah, the group of just like cop Uchihas that was walking around. That was my group of friends. And we got dragged down to the photo shoot by a bunch of other people in Naruto cosplays, and they kept forcing us to go up for photos for oh everything they could find an excuse for. And we were like, why are we so popular? We literally just decided to do these at 2 in the morning because we were tired and bored. But this gif is really funny. Let's do that. Oh my god. Millennials. So yeah, uh, I was finally able to go into dealers, and one of my longtime fandoms has gone to win. Like, found this shit at 12 years old when they aired it on Toonami, and I was just like, yeah, <laughs> that's for me. Um, and it's just, because it's so old, it's either had, like, no merchandise, or trash merchandise, or it's all just Gundams. But I don't care about the Gundams, I just care about the characters. Even though the Gundams are pretty cool. So, I roll up into dealers, and what do they have? A goddamn Hero Yui figurine from my favorite shot in the opening like song uh -huh. is two hundred and twenty five dollars. I'm just like but I want it. <laughs> but I want it. I was like, okay, okay. That's a piece of furniture. That's like a car payment on a nice car. Yeah. Like walk away. So I'm like, okay, okay, so we leave it. I go back Saturday, it's still there. I was like, alright. No, it's still can't do it, still can't do it. Then I think Saturday afternoon, Tori shoots me a message like, hey, I found that figure for cheaper, but it's not in the box. I was like, okay, well, how much cheaper? It's like 140 I was like, oh, shit. Like, yeah, that's like $80? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. So I was like, okay, okay, I, I'll, I'll, go, I'll go look at it at least, see if it's like in good shape or whatever. Um, so I go over there, and it's like there, and I'm like, oh, yes, it's perfect. So I was like, okay. I'll get it. So I pay for it. The guy comes over and he's like, alright, I'll go I'll go grab it out of the back for you. I was like, alright, neat. He comes back and he's like, actually it's the last one, so I can box that up for you. I'm like, it comes in a box! <laughs> <laughs> and it was the last one! And it was the last one! <laughs> I got it! <laughs> yep, so now now I have my like the only decent piece of Gundam Wing merchandise that was ever put out ever. <laughs> like yeah. one of the original songs. Yes, that's the OG, the OG son. So would you say that's your favorite part of your convention experience? Uh, that was pretty good. I also liked showing up as beaten, bloody prompto and Tori just going, get out of here. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Me? What um, was your favorite part of this I convention? I had a lot of fun being a shitty ass king. That was great. Yeah. The shitty ass king, I mean, oh. Yeah. Um, not the other one. No, <laughs> the other one. I mean, Whoa, what? <laughs> wow. This is not a shitty game. 
Brian just ranting about how angry we were about it. Yeah. Oh, so Yes, yeah, I should have taken one too. <laughs> but when I was in the dealer, I uh, bought the best boy. You bought the best boy? Here's a reference for the best boy. Cover, like fun with Oh, I have a photo of a. What? Uh, okay, there we go. Very nice. Hey, that's what I spent $140 on. Anime conventions. <laughs> okay, uh, sorry. For reference, it was a figure of this best boy. Ooh. The best boy ever. Yeah. So yeah, that was fun. Yeah. Of course, I was like being nauseous because I could just be me, so. Sleepy. I got shamed for having a sandwich with wheat bread. Yeah, you did. Because we've been nasty. I got shamed for having a sandwich. <laughs> yeah, we'll see you later, whenever. I don't know. We'll talk to you in the car probably. Yeah. So this is gonna be, obviously we left, but also this is gonna be in post editing. I'm gonna add this for our favorite moments because I changed my favorite moments because there was like a baby Link and he battled a Deathstroke and the Deathstroke was very like uh, hospitable to him and like if he hit his legs, his legs were gone and if he hit his like arm, he was down and it was very cute and everyone was rooting for Link and it was very super cute. So now we are leaving Yomakan and I have to show you the rest of my trash. My sweet ass galaxy print of the paladins. Fucking dope as shit. So this is my chance shame. So I blame Beck entirely for this purchase. Entirely. Because I got me into fucking chance tripping. So fun fact from the artist. This is the official Cuban flower. And this is a mermaid. So I'm supposed to be a mermaid. Yeah. It's fucking sweet. And a cute one. This is from the same artist. It's the chance one. I actually bought from her last year too. I bought a saucy plants from her last year. Which lives in my cosplay room. Which is on my bookshelf if anyone has seen that. It's very saucy. I don't know where else to put it. And here's my cute little uh, PG one. Plants. And then I got some Timcon. It's like fucking trash as shit. I came in like this little Polaroid set, and they had Timcon and they had JDick, but more of a Timcon, best friend kind of gal. So here's my Timcon Polaroid. Fucking Timcon, are you fucking kidding me? My little Polaroid set. Come back. Just because you're going to Disneyland, it'll be fucking lazy. Okay. Just give ba -ba -ba -ba. So that's the rest of my haul. Moral of the story is I spent way too much fucking money. That's the focus on me. Okay, don't shame me, camera. Because I spent way too much money. Yeah. So this is our last spot of the year, again, as always. And then our first con is going to be Wash Con, which is a college con for a little day. Very simple, very fun, easy, carefree con then my plan is c2v2 courtney might be going with me then it'll be katie pyro and i'm trying to get my fiance josh to go with me so let's see that then motor city comic con i think so then motor city comic Ooh, okay thank you excuse me rain first of all i'm finishing the vlog how dare you how dare you <laughs> oh okay okay so the motor city comic con which i think me and courtney are gonna try for a full weekend <laughs> and then pyro and katie will always be at asen then a colossal con then doki dokan i think is our lineup Yes. And then Yomaka. And then Yomaka again. We'll come full circle. Full circle. <laughs> I think, I don't know, I think I'm good. I'm, uh, oh, I love you guys. Thank you for watching and subscribing. If you're a subscriber, that's awesome. I still don't know how we have like 800 and something of you. I have no idea. Um, oh, I'll leave you with some really good jokes. Okay. Some great jokes for you, okay? All right. I bought 2,000 pounds of Chinese soup. It was one ton. Boy.